All right, get set for one of the coldest nights so far this winter season. We're looking for lows anywhere from the upper 20s to the mid 30s here across southeast Georgia and the low country. Already plenty cold out there this evening. Maybe another hour or two down the road will be falling into the middle 40s overnight. 31 degrees. If you have any plants outside you want to protect, I would say cover those up. Maybe slide them into your garage or carport if they're potted. And tomorrow morning, looking at some extra layers needed. The coat on chilly sunshine will be warming through the 30s and eventually into the 40s. Lows across the area tonight. Out on the islands, Hilton Head and Tybee, middle 30s, likely frost free there. Buford about 32 degrees, Pooler and Savannah 31, Metter, Statesboro out toward Vidalia, Hampton up in South Carolina, you'll be somewhere about 29 or 30 degrees with widespread frost. Now temperatures are already falling quickly through the 40s. Check that out. 44 in Statesboro, I'd say the next 90 minutes down into the 30s. Upper 40s for Ridgeland and Beaufort and down south of I-16, 46 in Hinesville, 45 for our friends in Alma. Now rain chances moving forward, nothing on Friday. Yeah, the weekend is here and with it another chance of at least a few showers. Not much rain on Saturday, a little more Saturday night or Sunday. And it's starting to appear Sunday's rain chance would hinge on the passage of a cold front. City cast for tomorrow after that frosty start. Richmond Hill warms up to 55 along with Bluffton. Tybee about 53 degrees. Hardyville, Vidalia somewhere around 54. You get the picture. It's another cool day. Highs will be stuck into the 50s across the area. Let's talk about the forecast now. Tomorrow afternoon, cool but dry here locally. Clouds thicken across the deep south, and then the moisture will at least try to filter in sometime a little later on Saturday. Partial sunshine early, clouds thicken. One or two showers try to move in from the Atlantic, but really not much moisture out there on Saturday. Sunday, a little better chance you'll need the umbrella. Maybe not early in the morning, but midday, afternoon. A line of showers will come cruising across the area. Certainly not expecting any severe weather and temperatures will be warming into the 60s. Very likely right around 60 Saturday and then by Sunday 67 degrees and something I want to mention here 10 days down the road. Mark your calendar. Don't forget about this. We have a total lunar eclipse coming up and it is visible across our entire viewing area. Here are the times and certainly we will be reminding you of that as we draw a little bit closer still. 10 days away. Shorter term though, let's just look at the next seven. 55 degrees for Friday with mostly sunny skies. Then the clouds arrive Saturday. A lower end chance of a shower during the afternoon or evening. A little better chance of scattered showers on Sunday. And then behind the system, we're looking at highs that will be dipping back to the 50s.